WCBI 60 Schools in 60 Days is brought to you by Toyota. Let's go places. And Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point. But it's not by chance. Alan Glenn is taking over at Amory after Ben Ashley's departure. Glenn most recently coaches under Trent Hammond at Tupelo. He spent time at Louisville and Saltillo as well. And he wins a state title in 1998 as a player at Amory under legendary head coach Bobby Hall. It's before he plays at Ole Miss. Very fortunate to, to walk into a situation that we have here at Amory, which is a great place. You know, Amory's always had really good players uh, throughout the years. So uh, just being able to inherit some really good players. Uh, is, I'm very fortunate and blessed to be here. It's an experienced group. The Panthers have 24 seniors. Glenn says those older guys can help him out as a coach. With a large senior class, it's been really good to have that because I've kind of relied on them to get to know the guys, and uh, they they kind of lead this team. You know, I, I really believe I'm a firm believer in players leading the team. You know, they a lot of times other players will listen to. They're the players they look up to. Amory makes the playoffs last year in a competitive division, but the team feels it hasn't yet achieved its goals. It's not what's expected from Amory, so it'll be good to get Amory back on the map. That's Z Gates. He's back at quarterback. The Panthers say they can feel the team coming together. Everybody on the team is on the same page. When one won, we all won it. So that just makes my team hungry. We have uh, been pretty straight on about it. We won a championship. And we can't get that unless we, unless everybody wanted and lead the lead. It'll be a run first team with a lot of skill guys. Glenn says the lines are a weakness, however. 60 Schools in 60 Days with Amory High School was brought to you by Monroe County Farm Bureau. And we have it worked.